Hey, how's it going? Today, I'm going to show you how you can send WhatsApp messages from your VB program. There are only four steps. For steps one, two, and three, just check out the link in the description and you'll find more information there. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use the sample VB code to send WhatsApp messages to registered people like yourself. Now, let's click on this vb.net link to see the source code. If you scroll down a little bit, you'll see the entire source code here. Let's drag the mouse and press Ctrl C to copy the code. Later on, we will paste the code in Visual Studio. Now, I will press Ctrl V to paste the code in Visual Studio. In case you don't know how to create this Visual Studio project, I'll briefly tell you how. Just go to File, New, Project. Over there, choose Visual Basic on the left-hand side. In the middle pane, you choose Console Application. Then you say OK. Alright, simple, huh? Let's get back to the source code. In this program, there is only one change you will need to make. Just one change. The change is on line number 61, over here. As you can see, there are just two parameters in this line. The first parameter is the destination number. That is, the number you want to send the message to. In this case, it's going to be your own number. Okay? Don't forget to include the country code of your number. For example, if you are from the United States, the country code is 1, so you will have to put down 1 at the beginning of the number. The second parameter is the actual message. I'm going to change this message to something different. Let's put down this is my vb.net program. So, this is going to be my message. Alrighty, let's run the program. It's very simple to run the program. All you have to do is press the start button right here. Let's do it now. Just click the button. And that's it. See, this is my VB program. The message has been sent. Was that simple? I think it was incredibly simple. So, if you also want to have some fun sending WhatsApp messages, give it a try. I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching.